Hey guys, I have been laying in bed all day. I really don't really have it in me to do anything today. I just am so lazy. Um, and I feel like I really need to just be laying in bed today and just rest before I have to go to work again on the day after tomorrow. I went out with one of my girlfriends yesterday. We just had a few glasses of wine and we had some dinner. And it was really good. Originally, I was gonna go out with my co-workers, but I didn't end up doing that and I just went out with her, which I'm really grateful for because I don't feel any kind of hangover today, which is just perfect. But I am really tired. I did go to bed kind of late because my downstairs neighbors were hosting a birthday party I guess and they were just really loud so I didn't go to bed until like 2 a.m. I don't really have a lot planned today I am home alone until tomorrow I think I'm gonna order some food at some point um, I didn't eat much today um, so I think I'm gonna have to order some food I think I want something really delicious also I saw this TikTok and the guy was like if you're always complaining, you might not be feeling too well and you might not be making any changes because you just feel so comfortable being the one complaining all the time. And I just thought about my conversation with my girlfriend yesterday because I just realized I do complain a lot. I complain each and every day and I have been trying to cut down but I kind of just forgot to be aware of it um so i'm really gonna try to do prioritize not complaining in the future and this next week because i feel like it's so unnecessary for me to be complaining all the time like it literally gets me nowhere and i feel kind of bad the next day if i've just been up with my friends and just complaining the whole time and i also am not feeling too great when i'm out with people who are just complaining all the time um, so I really want to be aware of that and I really want to change that. So I'm going to prioritize that for the next time. Yeah, I just quickly wanted to mention it so I have to hold myself accountable to do it in the future. Anyways, I'm going to order some food and I'll see you guys later. I'm not naked, I am wearing a shirt. I just cleaned the entire apartment. I think I'm gonna order some McDonald's. I haven't had McDonald's in like forever. Because I really don't feel like going to the grocery store. Hi guys! It's a little later in the day now. I did eat my food, I did get it delivered and I did order McDonald's. Um, I always feel so shitty when I've eat mcdonald's and then i just have this need to reinvent myself it's kind of like almost like a new year's resolu resolution where i just tell myself i'm never eating mcdonald's again now I, I honestly don't know why i order it order it because every time i get it i feel like it's not good it's not that good can i just honestly not even speak or what's going on i was thinking about going for a walk um honestly i've been doing a lot of thinking today I kind of felt like I was using so much screen time. Like I have my show on on Netflix on the TV and usually I watch YouTube or whatever on my computer. And then I also watch TikTok on my phone. So that's like three screens at once. Um, which is honestly, when I think about it, it sounds so excessive. It sounds so unnecessary because who needs three screens? And I just had this feeling like, I don't feel like I'll find anything online that really will just keep me busy or keep me entertained for the next few hours or throughout the whole day. I really felt like I needed to just do something else than sitting and just scrolling or just watching something on a screen. So I did just kind of take the day off to read my book. I was talking about The Fall of the Narrow Stars. 
in the last vlog that I made that I started reading then. And honestly, I kind of didn't want to read it till the end because I already saw the movie and I had read it before and I kind of stuck. I kind of stopped in the midst of it because I just kind of didn't feel like it was that entertaining. But I was just reading today on my balcony, just out getting some fresh air. And I honestly really think it's very well written. I told myself I'm gonna read like at least one chapter, but I just ended up reading like five chapters in one sitting, which was perfect. I really like the book. I also feel like it's been so long since I saw the movie, so I kind of don't remember. Also, I just wanted to say for future reference and just for the last few vlogs, obviously English is not my first language. So if I sound really stupid, that's why. Um, and I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm trying to use the right words and I'm trying to pronunciate the words correctly yeah i hope it's not too bad i'm trying to get better i was actually trying to rehearse my english by reading my book out loud and just trying to pronunciate the words correctly um is that pronunciate or pronounce i was trying to pronounce the words correctly i don't know what this is is that a pimple I feel like each and every vlog I get a new pimple and I'm always like, is that a pimple? Yeah, this is a pimple as well. I've never had a pimple on my neck before. That's interesting. I feel like my skin hasn't been too bad the last couple of days. I did sleep with my makeup on yesterday, which was so stupid. And I wasn't even that drunk, I was just so tired and I didn't want to do it. Which is just annoying today. Mm -hmm. I should have done that. See, look at me. I'm complaining. I literally just said like four hours ago that I would stop complaining. I think I'm gonna go to bed pretty early today. I think you can kind of tell here and here how red my skin gets from using those makeup wipes. I know that it isn't good for my skin. I just, I, don't, I can't be bothered to go to the drugstore and just buy my nice little water. Um, tomorrow I am going to my dad's place to eat lunch with him. Okay, that's the skincare. I think I might actually just go to bed now. I'm just gonna put on my pajamas and go to bed and just wait to fall asleep. It's honestly, it's 7... Oh, okay, it's 8 p.m. So... It's pretty early, but I think I want to go to bed because then I'll be well rested for tomorrow. Um, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. But I just felt that I could just keep going, which is so weird because when I've been running the past two times, I just had such a hard time. But I usually have a hard time when it's in daylight, like when it's in the middle of the day. But then when it's dark outside, I have no problem running like a marathon. I've never ran a marathon. I'm just saying it hypothetically. Yeah, but I just felt that I could keep going and going and going and. Eventually, I just had to be like, okay, 
I don't want to strain my knees because it's been a long time since I ran such a long distance. This was not the right choice. I should have worn a t-shirt or something. Yeah, I ran like 14 kilometers. I'm really happy I did it. My time wasn't too great and my average pace wasn't that great either, but it wasn't too bad, um, which is what I'm going for. I'm trying to improve myself for every time I go out for a run. Yeah, I'm gonna take a shower and then I am probably gonna see you tomorrow. morning I drank my iced coffee and I just got a boost of energy so I cleaned the whole apartment again but I also vacuumed now I'm going to my dad's place just quickly gonna get ready because I am in a hurry I'm supposed to be there at 2 and that's in like 45 minutes and I have to bike there it's quite a long ride um, I actually have no idea how long it takes for me to bike there but I'm just hoping it's not more than half an hour. I didn't clean the bathroom because I just didn't have time for it. But yeah, I have some work to do today. I have to post some content for a brand on TikTok. I have to edit this video and upload it. Um, what else? Oh yeah, I have to respond to some emails. Um, and then I think that's about it. Okay, I think I'm gonna get going and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Mm -hmm. 